The Ngorongoro Conservation Area spans vast expanses of highland plains, savanna, savanna woodlands and forests, from the plains of the Serengeti National Park in the northwest to the eastern arm of the Great Rift Valley. The area was established in 1959 as a multiple land use area with wildlife coexisting with semi-nomadic Maasai pastoralists practicing traditional livestock grazing. It includes the spectacular Ngorongoro crater, the world's largest caldera, and Olduvai Gorge, a 14 km long deep ravine. Extensive archaeological research has also yielded a long sequence of evidence of human evolution and human environment dynamics, including early hominid footprints dating back 3.6 million years. Within the central part of the conservation area live the Maasai people. Originally the pastoralists who migrated south from Kenya into the Serengeti in the early 1800s. They were moved into this area in 1959 when the Serengeti Game Reserve was created and now live as agro-pastoralists mainly in permanent settlements. The unique coexistence of wild animals, domesticated animals and people in the same environment. The Maasai living culture among the wildlife practically substantiates our understanding on past life ways millions of years ago. The combined works of nature and humans over time and has still potential to yield more information on evolution of humans, other animals and flora. Ngorongoro Conservation Area has yielded an exceptionally long sequence of crucial evidence related to human evolution and human environment dynamics. Ngorongoro is home to lush green rain-watered vegetation as well as desert plants. The area has uncultivated lowland vegetation, arid and semi-arid plant communities, abundant short grass used for grazing and highland forests. Scrub heath, grasslands, high open moorland and the remains of dense evergreen forests cover the steep slopes of the crater, while highland trees including peacock flower, yellow wood, koso and sweet olive can also be found. Ngorongoro Crater is the largest unbroken caldera in the world. The crater together with the Olmoti and Impakai craters are part of the eastern rift valley whose volcanism dates back to the late Mesozoic, early tertiary periods and is famous for its geology. The property also includes Leutali and Olduvai Gorge which contain an important paleontological record related to human evolution. The crater is the flagship tourism feature for the Ngorongoro Conservation Area. It is a large, unbroken, unflooded caldera formed when a giant volcano exploded and collapsed some three million years ago. The Ngorongoro crater sinks to a depth of 610 meters, with a base area covering 260 square kilometers. The height of the original volcano must have ranged between 4,500 to 5,800 meters high. Millions of years ago, the site comprised of a large lake, the shores of which were covered with successive deposits of volcanic ash. Some 500,000 years of seismic forces diverted in a nearby stream, which began to cut down into the sediments, revealing the seven main layers in the walls of the gorge. The property has global importance for biodiversity conservation in view of the presence of globally threatened species such as the black rhino, the density of wildlife inhabiting the Ngorongoro crater and surrounding areas throughout the year, 
and the annual migration of wild beast, zebra, thompsons and grand gazelles and other ungulates into the northern plains. The stunning landscape of Ngorongoro crater, combined with its spectacular concentration of wildlife, is one of the greatest natural wonders of the planet. The mixture of forests, canyons, grassland plains, lakes and marshes provide habitats for a wide range of bird life. The wet months see the arrival of the Eurasian migrants at the pools. White storks, yellow wagtails and swallows mingle with the local inhabitants. Stills, saddle-billed storks, ibis, roof and various species of duck. Some animals, such as buffalo, wild bees and zebra, migrate out of the crater during periods of drought and considerable effort is being made to prevent the migration route from being encroached upon by settlements and agricultural developments. The zebra includes six subspecies that each differ in the pattern of their black and white stripes. They all graze in large herds on tall grasses. The blue or brindle gnu is also known as a wild beast. During the dry season, they congregate by tens of thousands and migrate over hundreds of miles in search of water and food. They follow zebra herds, which graze on tall grasses, leaving the shorter grasses for gnus and other herbivores. Ngorongoro Conservation Area is home to a population of some 25,000 large animals, mostly ungulates, alongside the highest density of mammalian predators in Africa, including the densest known population of lion. Social groups of lions, called prides, are composed of 1 to 3 males, 2 to 15 females and their offspring. Sometimes young males form their own satellite group. The males protect the territory and get to eat first. The lionesses do most of the hunting. They generally stalk and chase their prey, killing with a bite to the neck, although they can also kill with a single back-breaking swat of the paw. Lions usually hunt at night and spend almost 20 hours a day sleeping or lounging with their playful cubs. Ngorongoro crater has a high number of spotted hyena. Warthogs belong to the bull family. These tough animals are distinguished by large heads and warts, or thick protective pads, on both sides of the head. They also have spots of dense fur on the throat and back. Both male and female warthogs have tusks. Thompson's gazelles are mainly grazers, feeding on grasses, herbs and leaves of plants in the open plains. Their herds, which are composed of a dominant male, females and their young, contain anywhere from 5 to 50 individuals. There are 371 species of birds recorded at the Norongorongoro crater. Ostrich, quarry busted and grey-crowned crane are regularly encountered in the grassland on the crater floor, where superb starling, rufous-tailed weaver and rosy-breasted longclaw are abundant. Giraffes are the tallest land mammals in the world with heads that may tower six meters above ground. Their great height allows them to reach the leaves of the spiny trees that are their staple. 
They pluck the buds, fruits and leaves of these trees with prehensile upper lips and long tongues that can be extended up to 45 centimeters. The African elephant, the largest living land mammal, is distinguished from the smaller Indian elephant by its size and huge ears, which it flaps to cool off and to keep bugs out of its eyes. The trunk, an extension of its upper lip and nose, is used for activities such as drinking, bathing, smelling, greeting, grasping and bringing food, grasses, leaves and fruit, to its mouth. It can eat more than 135 kilos of food in a day. Hunted for centuries for their ivory tusks, elongated incisors, these elephants are now protected, but poaching and habitat loss still threaten them. Troops of olive baboon and vervet monkey are also common. A number of monkey species can also be seen. Red colobus, baboons, velvet, red-tailed and blue monkey. Other primates include bush pigs and bush bucks. Open grassland covers most of the crater floor, turning yellow with wild flowers in June. One of the quintessential images of the crater floor, the shallow Lake Magadi, attracts huge flocks of flamingo as well as other birds. Flamingos are very common at lakes in the park, all of which are saline. Flamingos are filter feeders and feed on plankton. Plankton is a collective name for microscopic plants and animals that occur in the mud and on the surface of shallow saline lakes. The variations in climate, landforms and altitude have resulted in several overlapping ecosystems and distinct habitats, with short grass plains, highland catchment forests, savanna woodlands, montane long grass plains and high open moorlands. From the Greek word meaning river horse, hippos are larger than most terrestrial mammals. The hippo is a bulky, barrel-shaped amphibious mammal with an enormous muscle. The males can be up to 5 meters long, stand 1.5 meters high and weigh 3,500 kilograms. The Ngorongoro Conservation Area boosts the finest blend of landscapes, wildlife, people and archaeological sites in Africa. 